with that. I'm sick of trying this four hundred times. The end is upon your fucking ass. Actually, suck at you. Okay, so he's still going to. Let me pull up the tooth. There, suck it, you bitch. Fuck you. Well, now we get to try something that someone suggested I try, because they watched the video where I completely destroyed Leshy with, uh, by, by removing the sigils from the moon, and then I just destroyed him. So, what I want to do this time is try removing the sigils and then see how the card even attacks, if it does or if it can. So, goodbye to all your damn sigils, you bitch. Okay, now we'll just do this and see what happens. So we're not going to completely kill him. Oh. Shit. I'm going to attempt to try that again. Okay, here we go. Remove the Mothman. We can't have the Mothman there, or this ain't gonna work. Now let's see what happens. Attack. Okay, so the moon still does attack. It just attacks like once. And it looks like it can only attack the first, the first creature. Huh, okay, well that's honestly kind of boring. Well, there you go. So not very much happens. The moon, the moon still just attacks, it just attacks for one damage because that's all it has, and it only attacks, I think, the first card there. It, it basically, it, if you remove all the sigils, it, it basically just assumes that it's a single card. Are you kidding me, really? It just assumes that, that it's a single card in the first slot, first space. Oh, what's this? Curious egg. Had just been drawn if the numbers 1 to 5 are represented in the health of creatures in your deck and in their power and if there's a creature of each tribe in your deck. What? Okay. That's complicated. And then you start a deck unlocked. Just a bunch of those. Great. And challenge unlocked. Ooh, grizzly bosses. Grizzlies appear during the first three boss battles. Fucking hell. 